Good morning, everybody. Happy Labor Day weekend. Hope everybody's enjoying themselves. Uh, I got the alligator right here. And uh, hopefully today I'm gonna finish seaming it and attaching everything I have. A new tail that I'm gonna be adding to it, as well as the other arm. So once I get these attached right here and right there, I'll seam the whole thing. Again, I'm only using like foam really likes to stick to itself. So I'll use that. And once it's all seamed, I'll, I'll show you guys the finished product. All right, so I've cut off the tail in the front forefront. You can see this one that didn't fill all the way. This one right here is much better. So I cut it in such a way that this is the original. This is the new one. And since it came out of the same mold, I just cut across that line right there. So it wants to fit in like a puzzle piece and it'll be much easier to seam and attach. They said it couldn't be done. They laughed at me when I tried. A one piece, fully flexible, only foam crocodile. I'm actually, in all seriousness, very proud of the way this came out. Uh, that detail, you can see that I seamed it with a hot tool right there, but right here, like, oop, look at all that. Great flexibility. At first glance, you can't tell where the seam is. Did the arm right here and just kind of patched that up on the bottom with some other pieces that we had lying around. And we're gonna mail this bad boy out later on this week. All right, just so you guys can get like an appreciation for how big this thing is and how much flexibility I can get out of it. I'll pick it up, <clears throat> much bigger than me. Wonderful movement in the tail. <clears throat> and I had the time of my life. You can see right there, detail all the way around. <clears throat> you can see him right there plenty of flexibility. I could bend him really well without it tearing or ripping anywhere. This guy will take a beating. So, you know, we're happy with that all day. There's the side that I had to seam where it collapsed. That side a little less seaming. But yeah, you can, he'll bend and, you know, you can really muscle this thing around. It's, it'll take a beating. That's why we love Foam It by Smooth On. All right, everyone, that's pretty much gonna do it for this alligator project. Uh, thank you for watching the videos and hopefully pretty soon I'll have another video or a series of videos to show you guys of what I've been doing and other uh, hurdles to jump and, and new ways creatively that we can figure out problems to solutions or solutions to problems. That sounds better. All right, I'll see you guys next time.